Discover the timeless charm of sand clocks, then dive into the modern realm with a digital twist. This journey led to 3D, printed cases, matrix models, and intricate programming, all aimed at recreating the magic. Despite hiccups in Arduino programming and LED orientation, the digital sand clock emerged, bridging the past and present. Join the conversation, which version captures your fascination, the traditional or the digital? Have you ever wondered how a robot can balance itself on two wheels? This video shows you how to make your own self-balancing robot using an Arduino Nano, MPU6050, A4988 driver, and HC05 Bluetooth module. The robot uses NEMA 17 stepper motors and A4988 stepper motor drivers to react to the data sent by the MPU6050 Euro sensor. The robot can be controlled using a smartphone through Bluetooth, allowing you to move it forward, backward, left, and right. Imagine the sense of accomplishment you would feel after successfully building your own self-balancing robot. Have you ever wanted to create something amazing with just a few simple components? Imagine building an 8x8x8 LED cube using an Arduino Uno, some LEDs, and a few other basic components. This video tutorial by Harry Lu shows you how to do just that. With the source code and schematic provided on his GitHub, you can follow along and create your own mesmerizing LED cube. Have you ever wanted to create something unique and eye-catching for your home? This video by The Wrench shows you how to make an amazing hollow clock using an Arduino and a stepper motor. The clock is made using a 3D printer, and the creator provides the codes, STL files, and Gerber file with upgraded STLs on his website. The original author of this project is at Shura. The clock is not only functional but also a beautiful piece of art. The hollow design allows you to see the inner workings of the clock, adding an extra layer of entry. Imagine the sense of accomplishment you would feel after successfully building your own hollow clock. And the best part? You can customize it to fit your own style and preferences. Choose your favorite colors, materials, and design elements to make it truly your own. So why not give it a try and see what amazing things you can create? Credit goes to The Wrench for creating this amazing tutorial. Are you tired of fumbling with keys or forgetting your passcode? This video by Creativity Buzz shows you how to make a fingerprint door lock using an Arduino Uno. With just an Arduino Uno, Adafruit fingerprint sensor, and a servo motor, you can easily lock and unlock your door using your fingerprint. Imagine the convenience and peace of mind that comes with knowing that only authorized individuals can enter your home. And the best part? You can insert up to 127 fingerprint IDs in the sensor to lock and unlock. So why not give it a try and see what amazing things you can create with this project? It's a fun and rewarding challenge that will add an extra layer of security to your home. The video shared by the user is a tutorial on how to make a DIY Arduino human following robot by DIY Builder. This robot is not only fun to build, but it can also be helpful in many ways. For example, it can be used as a personal assistant to follow you around and carry your things, or as a companion for children or elderly people. The robot can also be programmed to perform various tasks, such as delivering items or navigating through a maze. Overall, this project is a great way to learn about robotics and have fun at the same time. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more content like this.